Yo, what's good? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time here, I go by the name of DJ Focus. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to chop up a sample. And once we chop up that sample, I'm gonna make a beat with it. So let's get into it. So this is the sample we're gonna be chopping up. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna double click on my uh, sample. So once this window comes up, you're gonna hit edit and audio editor. And then once this uh, window pops up, this is where you can actually chop up the sample. And this sample is by Illmind. And I'm gonna get rid of this uh, space right here. So you guys can see it's like all this dead space. So let's get rid of that first. All right, so as you guys heard that, I just want the beginning of this as of now. So let's cut that up. So it looks like this is the beginning of the next sound. So let's just chop this one up here. And we're going to hit this uh, button up here so it can loop it. All right, so now that we got that, now I'm going to click this button up here so I can save it to my uh, workspace. So now let's work on this other half. All right, so you guys heard that it just loops perfectly fine and that's what you're looking for when you're chopping up a sample. All right, so now let's save that to our workspace. So now the next thing I wanna sample is this. It's like pretty much the end. All right, so this is what I want. So I'm gonna save that. Now let's do the last part. So I'm liking that, so let's save it. So everything that we just chopped up, as you guys can see, it's saved right here. So this is our workspace. So now let's get rid of the sample up here. And now we can just work with these. So the first one I wanna chop up is probably the piano. So let's work with that one first. As you guys can see right here, this is not on beat. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna chop this up right here. So let me cut it. And I'm gonna put this to uh, none. All right, so it's already at none.
are right, so i'm liking how this sounds so i'm gonna leave it alone now the next thing we're gonna chop up is this one so i'm gonna do the same thing and cut this up so it can be on tempo All right, so I'm liking this so far, but it sounds really empty right here. So I'm just going to add something. I'll fix that part later. So let's just go up to this one. Alright, so I'm liking that, so I'm gonna leave it alone. Now I'm gonna come up to this one and fix this one up. As you guys can see on this one, it does not go the whole way. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna chop this right here and then bring this over so it could fit my uh, last bar. And as you guys can hear that, it sounds perfect. I'll let you guys hear it one more time. So basically the same thing I did up here, I'm going to do down here because like I mentioned earlier before, it's empty in this bar. So let's fix that. So what I'm thinking, I'm just going to bring this part and bring it over here. So it's going to sound something like, let's check it out. That actually sounds pretty good. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to keep messing around with this. And so yeah, that sounds a lot better than what I had before. So I'm gonna leave this alone. So now the next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna arrange these uh, samples together. So the beginning of my beat, I want this. And I also want my pianos. And right after that, I want this. So this is what it sounds like so far. All right, so I'm liking that. So the next thing I'm gonna work on is the drums. So the first thing I'm gonna start off with is the snare.
All right, so pretty much I got the whole beat done. The next thing I got to do, I just got to arrange the track. And thanks for watching. Until next time, I'm out.